Hello, hello. Good evening. Good evening. Hello, hello, hello. Good evening. Welcome to the class, everybody. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you today? I'm very tired, teacher. Sorry. I imagine. Yeah. Thanks for the effort. Thanks for being here. And right. what about you? So far, so good. Thanks for asking. Just suffering because of the weather because it's, it's pretty hot, but great. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, and there is a few, everyone. Who else is there? Hello, hello. Oh my gosh, I think that they are listeners. All right, well, welcome to the class, everybody. I'm happy to see you here. Thank you for being on time. It's Thursday, almost Friday, everybody, so let's resist a little bit okay remember guys that we are almost finishing this level all right imagine like a couple of more classes and it's over and you will be in intermediate six that's the last level in the intermediate everyone and then, of course, go to the pro level. And are you ready for that? Are you ready for the next level? Yes? Yes, teacher. We are ready. Excellent. Only Osman is ready, so. We had, we had to try. <laughs> That's the attitude. Why not? Don't be afraid. So, I want you guys to feel confidence. You have been working very hard, so you are more than ready for this. Now, remember, something, guys. Something we have to know. Uh -huh. to something we have to learn. Absolutely. You have to do it. But you can do it. Don't be afraid about it. <laughs> I mean, you already did the most difficult one. I think that the first levels are the most the most difficult. So this one is just to continue practicing, okay? Now, how is the platform going? Uh-huh. They completed. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. And the rest of you guys, have you worked on the platform? Yes, yes it's just... working on it. I hope so, I hope so. Remember, our last day is next Tuesday. So next Tuesday is our last class. So before Tuesday, the platform has to be done. All right? So you can do it, guys. Don't give up. You can do it. So please, if you have some questions with the exercises, as I always said, you can tell me and we can resolve the exercises here together in the class, okay? Now, do you remember the topics that we have been studying? Um, something, any, I don't, anyone, something. <laughs> I don't remember the topic, but the, the, the content, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that is important, don't worry. What else? Uh, definite words. Definite, in definite words? <laughs> Close. Definite? Mm. <laughs> definite pronouns. Actually, oh, if you remember, we studied both indefinite and definite. So what is the def uh, what is the difference? Do you remember? Um, definite are articles and the others are uh, and the, the words with any no and uh, pronouns uh, yeah yeah that is the one exactly we were starting indefinite pronouns that are the ones that your classmate mentioned anything anyone something someone 
And we have been studying the definite articles. Can you remember the definite articles? Uh, on the. Yes, that's the one. So that is what we are going to continue practicing today. So I hope that you remember a little bit what we studied because we are going to continue with that, okay? The idea, guys, is to learn in which scenarios we need the article the and in which scenarios we don't need it or it is not totally necessary, okay? So that is what we are going to do. Let me start sharing the presentation. Let's see, let's see. Okay, 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 give me a moment. Can you see the presentation, everybody? Yes. Yes? yes. yes. Excellent. Yes. All right, so today is September 7th. We are in the last week almost finishing the last unit and the topic for today is zero article yesterday we learned how to use the article the a and n right so today we are going to learn the scenarios where we don't need the article when the article is not totally necessary, okay? Now, this is the class objective. I need a volunteer for reading, please. Uh -huh. I, <laughs> I will do it. Go ahead, go ahead. Um, at the end of the class, participants will understand and learn how to use the zero article and common expressions for making apologies, excuses, and promises. Thank you. Oh, so, <laughs> promises. So we are going to divide the class into parts. First of all, we are going to practice the zero article, and then we are going to learn some common expressions, guys. We are going to have some role plays about making apologies, excuses, and promises, okay? Oh. I'm interested in the excuses. <laughs> ah, <laughs> all right. We are going to see how good are you at making excuses. Hmm. <laughs> all right. So we'll, let us start first. Let me see if you remember. Um, when or in which scenarios, guys, do I need the article the? Do you remember? Um, the second mention. In commission, yeah. Common place. I'm sorry. Uh, common place. Common places, yes. Instruments. Relative. Musical Music. instruments. Instrument. Mm -hmm. What else? Uh, the first mention. The specific <laughs> things. The specific things, yes. What is the other one? To refer to something unique. Very good. Well, we have only one thing in a category. That's good. It's missing one. Superlative. The superlatives. Very good job. Very good job. So when we are talking about those scenarios, remember, we need the article the. Okay. And hmm, when do I need the article a uh, or an? On, on the first mention. Yes. Jobs for first mention. Descriptions. Yeah. Descriptions, that's the one, All right? So in those scenarios, we are using definite pronouns. Pretty good job. Now let's practice a little bit. I want to start um, this class speaking as always. So let's start some practicing with the definite articles. I have some sentences here. 
These are simple questions. I mean, they are very easy to answer. The idea, guys, is that you can answer the questions and you have to decide if you need the article da, if you have to use a or an. For example, what is the currency of your country? Hmm, what is the meaning of currency? Money. Money. Exactly. So, mm -hmm. what is the currency in our country? Salvadorian colon. <laughs> well, in this moment, officially is. Dollar. 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 Bitcoin. Ah. Bitcoin, right? Yeah, <laughs> that's true. I haven't I haven't thought about it, but yeah, that's true. So if you see when we answer, we are saying the dollar. Okay. I'm not saying a dollar. Ah, the official currency is a dollar. Can I say that? No. No. Not really. Right? So, which musical instruments can you play, for example? The guitar. Uh, the guitar. <laughs> ah, can I say, ah, I can play a guitar? No. Not really? No. Because that means that you can play only one. If somebody gives you another guitar, mm -mm. no, right? So, musical instruments, we need the article that. So the idea, everybody, analyze the questions and decide if you can answer them using the or a or an. Is it clear? Yes. Yeah? Pretty good. I'm going to send the questions on WhatsApp groups and everybody, please enter to the breakup rooms and practice with your classmates. Today, guys, the idea is to have a lot of practice as always, but I need to everybody try to participate, okay? Remember, the more you practice, the more that you will learn. I'm sending um, the questions on WhatsApp groups. Give me a second. And before going to the rooms, I'm going to check attendance. So when you listen to your names, please say present. Amanda Leonela Zamora. Okay, Ana Lorena Lovato. Boris. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Boris Alexander Cortez. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Alberto Dominguez. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Ernesto Hernandez. Present teacher. Thank you. Carlos Mauricio Menjiva. Present. Thank you. Edwin Antonio Quinteros. Elias Nestalí Martínez. Eulice Torres Torres. Irma Evelyn Rodríguez. José Salvador Bernal. Present, teacher. Thank you. Um, Josman Atilio Serrano. Kevin Alexander Pérez. Present. Thank you. Kevin Alfredo Lucero. Present. Thank you. Maria Jose Siguenza. Okay. Nelson Alberto Peraza. Present. Thank you. Oscar Alexis Lara. Present. Thank you. Osman Enrique Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you. Pamela Carolina Molina. Present. Thank you. Rafael Alexander Serna. Okay. Present. Thank, thank you. Ricardo Ernesto Perez. Listener. Thank you. Cifrido Ernesto Gomez. Right. Wilber Alberto Perez. And Andrea Jamilet Mendoza. All right. Pretty good. So I already sent the questions on WhatsApp group. So let's go and practice, everybody. Um, Again, remember that we are a team, 
if you have a classmate that is not participating, try to push them in order that everybody can answer the questions. As I mentioned, the questions are not so complicated. So I think that they are easy to answer. Now, just let me create the groups. One moment. If you are in a group where your classmates are not participating, let me know and I will switch you to another team. Let's go to practice. Where do guys? <laughs> We are complete in this room. <laughs> Hi, Kevin. Hi. Do you want to ask? Um, I, I start with the first question, then you and then Pamela. And you agree? OK. Uh, so I, I mean, uh, you I ask, you answer, then you ask to Pamela and then Pamela answers and then Pamela ask and then I answer. Do you understand? <laughs> oh, Kevin, welcome. Welcome, Kevin. Well, let's start. I'll do the first one, then you, Rafael, you answer it, then you continue. <laughs> okay, yeah. nice. Okay, what is the currency of your country? Uh... The currency of a country is the dollar. It's the dollar, yes. The dollar and the Bitcoin. Yes, yes. Okay, so nice. The dollar because the dollar is a proper name or, or what? Or what we use? Or why we use the the? I think it's because the proper name. Proper name. Okay. Yes. And, 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 and no, it's because it's an unique thing, the dollar. Right, teacher? <laughs> I'm not sure. Uh -huh. oh. You tell me. Why I'm, like, you I'm not think? sure. <laughs> I think that it's because it's a uh, uh, unique thing. It's not, it, the dollar is uh, uh, only, it's only one, uh, only. <laughs> Don't com sure. don't complicate yourself, guys. Keep it simple. Remember, okay. when when do we need to use a uh, and an? Then first mention jobs and description. Mm -hmm. um, so we are not talking about anything about it. Yes. And in okay. this case, <laughs> we can talk about a specific thing. Specific. Are we talking about something specific? I mentioned the currency. Is that something yeah. specific? Yes. Mm. So that's the reason why. Okay. And if I live in Mexico, my currency is uh, Mexican peso. peso. The peso. Peso. Yeah. The peso. Exactly. The peso. The peso. Mm. Okay, mm -hmm. uh, and what about you, Kevin? Uh, what, 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 do you <laughs> where, where do you live and what is your current currency in your country? Um, I, I live in Japan and the currency is the yen. The yen, <laughs> okay. Uh, what is the next? The okay. next question. How Which about, mu musical about, instrument? I didn't listen ah, to it, where she lives. <laughs> yes, Pamela, Pamela. Where, where, where do you live, Pamela? Where are you from? What is your <laughs> currency, currency in your country? Um, here in my country, I live in Guatemala. <laughs> in my what is your currency? The Quetzal. I don't Quetzal. know if that's correct. The Quetzal, right? Yes. yes. Okay. And so, which let's... musical instruments can you play, Rafael? 
Well, I play the harmonic. Harmonic. Right. Yes. What is it? Um, I don't have <laughs> my harmonic <laughs> near to me, but um, it's a, oh. a box of wood um, laton. It's okay. a wind instrument. Do you know? Harmonic? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I I am look, looking for in Google right now. Uh -huh. Okay. <laughs> um Kevin, which yes. instruments can you play? I can play the computer keyboard. <laughs> uh I can play the piano. <laughs> I want to know. I am a doctor. I am a doctor. <laughs> you seem like a programmer, like a hacker. <laughs> Anonymous. <laughs> What's your face is free, <laughs> Where is the mask? <laughs> um, We're all anonymous. <laughs> right here. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Nah, in in the in the question number four, the answer is with A or N. Yeah. Next, what is your favorite animal? Huh? No, mm -hmm. but. But Carlos, I think you're choosing, you're choosing the articles, but you don't, you are not answering the question. In your case, what is your occupation? Yes, I said. Well, I didn't, I didn't listen to you. No, man. I, What's your occupation? I said Repeat it, it, please. Twice. <laughs> you say doctor. That's that's the one. No, 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 no. That that's not true. Uh, <laughs> okay. I am a WFM analyst. W what? WFM analyst. Workforce manager analyst. I don't even know what that is. It's something like a data analyst. Nice. And you like your job? Yes. I have here. Uh, I am here. Uh, I, uh, I have uh, five years in this That's position nice. That's yes nice. and i grew up five years ago and um, before that three years more always in wfm but not this um not not this um company area area something like that no Level, okay. not in this level, oh, not okay. in this level. Uh -huh. right. So go with the next question, or if you want to answer the four one. The four one? The the four. Answer. <laughs> <laughs> you said anonymous, but I don't believe you. <laughs> <laughs> I said anonymous, he is an anonymous. <laughs> well, my actual position is a uh, support technicians, but I uh, actually my degree as i said like that is is, is an engineer <laughs> in my degree says that i'm a, an account a counter a counter that's the word right? contador a counter right yeah no, you don't know in my in my case my my degree is a counter but i'm a mechanic of course <laughs> so i'm far away from my <laughs> for my studies <laughs> mm. <laughs> and, and you are a good mechanic? Yes, I'm super good mechanic. And your I is believe deeper? it. No, no, that's deeper? not. I, uh, I, I don't, I don't get what I deserve. Really? Yes. Okay. And I'm starting. We are talking about your job later, okay? I will okay. write it on WhatsApp. How about <laughs> how about how about bodies and Elias? I think they are listeners. Are you sure? They are missing here. 
we were asking I, I don't give the, their the voices. Answer. All right, so Boris, are you there? All right, Elias. Yes, I, I hear. Oh, All right. Yeah. I, I hear, I listen. I listen. The, can... the case me. All right, so can you try to participate? Go ahead. No, okay. I'm sorry. No, what? What? Is, what is your occupation, Boris? My occupation is um, a manufacturing coordinator. Coordinator. Oh, right. Mm, okay. Okay. Uh, yeah. And Elias, are you there, Elias? All right. I think he's not there. Okay. Continue, guys, and please, Boris, continue practicing. Uh, okay. We we have uh, some uh, um question here. The number three. Where do you want to go this weekend? Uh, we are not sure about what is the correct article. Is a, an or da? I think it's that, but I'm not sure. <laughs> it depends. So, remember what we talked about yesterday. We use the article da when we consider or when we believe that the listeners already know mm -hmm. what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. if it is the first time that you mention it, so... It's the only one, it's ah. Uh-huh, because remember that the is only for the second... The second mention. Mention. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. So tell me, where do you want to go? Uh, to the beach. I <laughs> know uh, to the beach. I want. I want to go this weekend. Uh, the park. The park. Is Which correct. Park? Which park? Um, uh, the park bicentenario. Bicentenario park. Bicentenario park. So everybody, do you know that place? Yes. Ah, nice. so in that case, we can say that ah, I would like to go to the Bicentenarius Park, mm -hmm. right? Okay, okay. Five okay. question. What's your favorite animal? Do you have a favorite animal? Yes, I think I, 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 I would like to do uh, something on my fear uh, mm -hmm. uh, fine totally I, I think we, we had to uh, we we most to do uh, uh, I like yeah yeah pienso que debemos hacer lo que nos gusta pero yeah yeah bueno, definitely no yeah, siempre we have to... am I listening to Spanish <laughs> <laughs> aliro teacher aliro aliro <laughs> we, we are speaking we are speaking a lot of English my goodness I will send you to another level but not the sixth one <laughs> oh, the, the conversation it's interesting teacher uh, only, uh, I have been in English speech, a Spanish speech <laughs> only a little speech in Spanish mm -mm -mm. okay yeah. so everybody don't let Osman speaking in Spanish, okay? Don't let Okay. <laughs> okay. Hey, Carlos, uh, go ahead. Yeah. Ah, okay. Uh, next, uh, number five. Uh, on, on yes, number yes, four. Yes, number five. Yes, number five. Uh -huh. Okay. Number five, what is your favorite animal? Ooh, I would like <clears throat> a lot of animals. For example, I, I like the cat, I like uh, Igor, the Igor, because for me it's interesting this animal, the Igor. Uh, ah. there, 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 are, there, are, there are a lot. Okay. And you, Andrea? Mm. I don't have 
like one specific animal, favorite animal that I really like cats and dogs. Cats? Ah, and dog. Okay. Yeah. Jose? Hi, uh, my favorite animal is, how do you say hippopotamo? Uh, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Hippo? Hippo? Hippo. Hippo. Hippo, yeah. Hippo. Hippo. Thank you. Hippo. 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 Hippopotamus. Ah, okay. Hippopotamus. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> yeah. Uh, we are inventing. <laughs> okay. I mean, when you say hippo, it's like the briefs or the short way to say it, but it is not like the correct one. The correct one is hippopotamus. Okay. Hippopotamus. Hippopotamus. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Nelson, why do you like hippopotamus? Me, no. <laughs> uh, oh, no, no, uh, Sal. Jose Salvador, excuse me. <laughs> because it is big, big. Okay. Very big. <laughs> I, I remember, I remember, I, I, I have a animal for me is uh, very interesting. Yes, the, how do you say, dogs? No socks. How do you say low in English? Wolf. 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 Yes. This animal for me is very interesting and beautiful. <laughs> okay. This animal is a strategic. Strategy. 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 I, I, I'm going to write 100 times this, this word because I forget. Pronunciation. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right. And you, Nelson? Uh, personally, I love the dogs. Uh, <clears throat> always. <laughs> but mm -hmm. if we're talking about wild animals, mm, could be crocodile. Crocodile. Mm. Oh. Mm -hmm. Because uh, crocodile is fantastic. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah. You have to go to Barrio Santiago. Why, you have to go to Barrio Santiago. Mm -hmm. mm. I want to go there, but uh, I never have uh, been in this place. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. The next, okay. the next, the next question. In my, in my case. <laughs> ah, yeah. Okay. In my case, is my favorite animal is a tiger. Tiger is beautiful. Tiger right? because uh, they have ability. The yes. feline. I don't know felino fel feline. Uh, they they have very ability. Uh, the best they uh, the best um, swimming yes the line. Mm -hmm. uh, I think all that okay next okay number six how is how is your city mm -hmm. hey people hey. let's start What's speaking the English <laughs> because uh, all the cities have one. So you, 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 you say the things that all the cities have. Yes. <laughs> well, I can say that that, <laughs> that, that the, this is the, the smallest city on this department. But I live, I live in Santa Ana. I don't know. Where do you live? Cities. Where do you remember live? remember that you are, yes, you are from Santa Ana. Santa Ana. <laughs> Yes, I am. I'm, I'm not from Santa Ana. I'm from La Libertad. It's, it's about to get to Santa Ana. Oh, okay. And how is 
Your City, la libertad, ok. Sí va a darse. Oh, my, the, 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 my city is Ciudad Arce. And it's the smallest uh, city that I know. <laughs> yeah. I really? visit Ciudad Arce something, sometimes. Yes, is it small? <laughs> yeah. I live in San Salvador, but, uh, but I was born in Chalchuapa, Santa Ana. Oh, that's cool. I know, Ch I know Chalchuapa. <laughs> yeah, it's a, a, con, a, con, a con town. Yes. Okay. And you, Pamela? I live, I live in San Salvador, um, here in, in San Jacinto, that it's like a, a small little town, <laughs> because I, I feel we have um, a lot of things here. We have the supermarket, we have the church, we have... Um, the park and the mall uh, and everything it's like it's close, close. <laughs> in, so, this, in this case so we that, need that's, to use, that's a good uh, thing about okay, the capital it's nicer. you have everything near to you yes yes yeah when we live outside the capital we have to, i have to travel like um uh, 30 minutes to get to a supermarket <laughs> really oh my god yeah yeah. And what is about? Is it is the same? A dog who uh, dies. The the main the main is Eugenio Derbez appears in that movie. Uh, we cannot accept um the evolution, something like that. But I can oh, I can say yeah. it in Spanish, but. Do you know what is the mean? Latin lover. <laughs> Latin lover? No, 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 Latin no, no, lover no, no. Was, was after. It's, it's, a, it's a sad movie, too. Yes, it's sad. The whole people know, uh, think uh, Eugenio will die. And... Instructions not included. <laughs> what? What uh, instructions it? not included. That's the name in English, yes. Uh -huh. And it's, it's a good a good film. Yeah. I really like it. Make you cry. <laughs> yes. Come on. You really love the sad movies, man. Yes. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> you realize it. Yes. With your girlfriend, come cry in my shoulder. <laughs> but of dinner. Time's up. Okay, time's up. We are going to wait for everybody to go back to the main room. All right, time's up, time's up. Let's go back to the main room, everybody. Let's wait for your classmates. Some of them are still in the breakup rooms. All right, everybody. How was the practice? Easy or difficult to answer the questions? Easy. No. Could you answer all of the questions? Yes, we could. Yes? We Did tried. You... <laughs> Excellent. Did everybody participate? Yes. Yes. Full English? Yes. 95%. Uh, <laughs> 99%. 99. That nine, oh, nine, on, nine, on, nine, only nine. two words in Spanish, teacher. Mm. Only two words. No, one word now, no more. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I in was, a half word. In a half. <laughs> oh my gosh. 
I was telling to one of your classmates that I will move you to another level, but it's not going to be the number six, <laughs> okay? So don't speak more Spanish, all right? Now, if you see, I was, I was listening guys to some groups answering the questions and I like the way that some of you were trying to analyze the answer. And some of you were trying to verify if you need to use a ah, or the article da, and that's great. Because now guys, you are being conscious about the definite articles, right? I know that sometimes we are just speaking and we are not paying attention to every single word that we are saying, but now you are paying attention. And that's great because that is going to help you guys to avoid grammar mistakes when you are talking about it, okay? Now, let me see. Um, Let me ask to some people. Let me ask to Osman because... He said that he he said only half of a word. <laughs> Osman, which musical instrument can you play? I can play anything, any any instrument, musical instrument, teacher. Oh really? And, yes. But which kind of instrument would you like to learn? Yes, I would like to play guitar. Guitar. Mm, only guitar? Guitar. Uh, Do I need piano, the article? Piano? Do I need the article if I say a, an instrument? Uh, the guitar. Ah, uh, that is the, the guitar. one. I would the like guitar. to play the guitar. Uh -huh. Also the piano. Mm, very good. Sounds good. Yeah. Oh, only that. Oh, only yeah. that. It, 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 it's interesting for me. Very good. Very good. Okay, Osman. Pick someone, please. Yes, Any teacher, of your in, in this moment, in this moment. A big uh, <laughs> uh, Let me see. Uh, Carlos, what the hell? Carlos. <laughs> Hello, Carlos. We have Carlos me. Ernesto, we Carlos have, uh, Dominguez, uh, and Carlos Carlos Mauricio. Carlos Ernesto. Ah, Carlos Ernesto. Uh, OK. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> All right. Hello, Carlos. Hello. Tell me, Carlos, what's your occupation? Ah, okay, my occupation is electrical technician, and the and the and my job is uh, technician in substation. Mm, do I need an article if I say my job occupation? Mm. So can I say I am teacher? Only that. Or what do you think? I am the teacher. I am teacher or I am a teacher or <laughs> I am an teacher. I don't know. You tell me, guys. What is the correct one? Mm, will be uh, maybe. Uh -huh. uh huh. I am, for example, yeah, I, I am a uh, teacher. Uh, All right. In my case, that's my job. Remember the rules, everybody. The questions. I don't pick the question just because I, I want that guys practice this question. No, the idea for each question is analyze the answer. Remember the rules. If I'm talking about a job, what is the article that I need? Uh, the article? Uh, so the uh, idea is, what is your occupation? Ah, I am a, uh, and you continue. With I am a technician, electrical technician. That is the one. However, if I say electrical, can I say a uh, or? An. That I'm an electrical one. technician. <laughs> Excellent. Yeah. Very good. Very good. I know, guys, that sometimes it's a little bit difficult, but with the practice, little by little. Very good, Carlos. Pick one of your classmates, please. Mm, let's see, let's see, Kevin Alexander. Kevin Alexander, hello, Kevin. Hello. Okay, Kevin, tell me, um, what's the best movie you have ever seen? 
the best movie I ever seen. Um, the best movie I ever seen is Avengers Endgame. Mm, okay. Hey, do you agree, everybody? Is that the best movie in the world? Could be. Could be. <laughs> could be. Yeah. Actually, yeah. Mario Bros. Um, Mario I didn't Bros. see that. I it's like another, it. It's I another. It's another movie. <laughs> Let Let's have a debate. Galaxy Guardians Three. I didn't no see way. it. I didn't see I it yet. Cried. Need for Speed. I yeah, the, the first one. Yeah, maybe. this movie is sad, but it's it's uh, beautiful. Yeah, it is. But I cried uh, on the whole movie, so don't watch it, guys. <laughs> Which, Which one? one? Sorry. Which one? Um. Yeah. The, the Guardian of Galaxy, the number three. Yeah. Oh. Make you cry, really. During the full movie, because I love animals, I can Me tolerate. Too. I yeah. can tolerate yeah. when animal. Animals. I mean, if a people or I mean, if people die, for me it's like ah. <laughs> but uh, when I see it, it's okay. Me too. Me too. Me too. <laughs> We're yeah. used to people it. die. <laughs> Whatever. But uh, animal die. Come on. Ah, uh, yeah. That's why I okay. have never seen John Wick just because of that. Because I know that a dog dies. So. <laughs> Yeah, Young Wick is another movie. This is a good franchise. Oh, no, my God. <laughs> there is a lot of movies that just because I know that some animals eyes, I don't watch them. Yeah. Ah, like Hashiko. I have yeah. never seen it. Never. Because I'm very sensitive <laughs> with that topic. All right, but look at this one. Analyzing these questions, if you see, remember, guys. Why do we say the dollar in the question number one instead of saying a dollar? It's not unique. No, no, it's, we are not talking about just a dollar, one dollar. Ah, very good. What else? Another reason? Are we talking about something specific? Yes or no? Yes. 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 That's why we say the dollar. We don't say a dollar because as your classmate said, it's not just only one. No. Right? Why do we say the piano instead of a piano? Uh, because no. you can play the, piano. the instrument. It's a music. So you say a uh, instrument. A piano exactly. is just one. That's correct. We remember if you are talking about musical instruments, I know that. Okay. And if you paid attention in all of these questions, the idea was to analyze what kind of question is this and the way that we are going to answer. Okay. Got it? Clear. Yeah. Any questions so far, guys, about the article da and a? Questions? No. Okay. Now that we already learned how to use the or an, now we need to learn when we are not going to use it. Okay? And that is the reason of the topic. Zero article zero article means that we don't need the and we don't need a okay so how can we use it there are different situations guys when the article the well it's not necessary okay which are those scenarios first of all when i'm talking about general meaning how is this or what does it mean? For example, if I say, I don't like children. What do you think, guys? Am I talking about a specific group of children? Am I talking about a specific child? Or no. is something in general? Mm -hmm. In this case, is something in general. For example, I don't like children. It doesn't matter if they are tall, if they are short. 
I don't like children, even if they are happy or not. No, they are just talking in general. This is the same from some people that they don't like some animals. For example, you can say, I don't like cats. Are we talking about one cat in a specific? Are we talking about a group of cats? No. Or not really. It's right? in general. It's just exactly. It's just cats. I don't like cats. For example, in my case, I don't like snakes. <laughs> Any kind of a snake. So it's in general. So when we are talking about a group in general, we say only the noun. We don't need the article that. For example, if you say, I don't like the snakes. In the moment that you say the snakes, what happens? It's a group in a specific. You are talking about something specific. Look at this one. Only one word can change the meaning. So if you say, I don't like the snakes. Okay, which ones? The biggest one or which ones? If you say, I don't like the children. Okay, which children? The ones in your city? The children in your church? The children in your neighborhood? Which children? Got it? Is it clear the difference? Yes. Yes? Remember, if you add the, it becomes in something specific. All right? So be careful, everybody, because that can give you some issues. Just imagine that you say, I, I don't like people. <laughs> Am I talking about something or someone in a specific? General. It's in general, right? But if I say I don't like the people, that can sound racist <laughs> because you are talking about a specific group of people. Will you be in problems if you say something like this? Yes or no? Maybe. Could be. Could be. Depending on the scenario, guys. Remember that Facebook, <laughs> it's banning all kind of comments. So be careful what you say. Remember, only one word can change the meaning of your sentences. So what else? We don't need or we don't use the article da when we are talking about meals. For example, when you are talking about breakfast, lunch, dinner, you don't need the article that. For example, um, I am cooking the breakfast. Can I say the breakfast? Mm -hmm. Not yes. really. In this case, it's the same, guys. We are talking in general. It's not necessary the article that. If you say the breakfast, I will ask, okay, the breakfast, which one, for who? You can say, I'm cooking the breakfast for my mother, for example, because in that case, again, is something specific, okay? But if you are just talking about meals, it's okay, you just say the meals. It's not necessary the article the. Understood? Yes. Yes? All right. Also, guys, when you are talking about years, months, days, you don't need the article the. For example, if I say, hey, when is the last class? Ah, the Tuesday. Mm, no, it is not necessary to say that. When is your birthday? Ah, uh, the July. Can I say <laughs> that? <laughs> not really, right? So when you are talking about years, months, days, you don't need the article that. Okay? 
When we mention the word TV, you don't need the article that. And that is another mistake because some people say, I was watching the TV. Is it necessary to say the article that? Not really, okay? When we are using the word TV and you are specifying that you watch it, you don't need the article the. On the other hand, we use the preposition on, okay? For example, I watch um, the series on TV, for example, okay? But the important thing is that you don't need the article the when you say the word TV. You don't need the word the when you are talking about languages. For example, if I ask you, which languages can you speak? Ah, I can speak the Spanish. Can I say that? The Spanish? No. Mm -hmm, not really, right? Ah, I can speak the English. Mm, no, okay? When we are talking about languages, we don't need the article the, okay? And if you are talking about subjects at the school, we don't need the article the, okay? For example, can you remember guys some subjects at the school? Eraser, pen, pencil, book. Okay, but subjects. Subjects, for example. Ah, subject, math. sorry. Uh-huh. Object. <laughs> <laughs> math, yeah. biology. Biology, math, uh, literature. If you see, when you are talking about subjects, we don't need the article the. I cannot say, ah, my favorite subject is the math. Mm, no, right? We only say the word math. Understood, everyone? Yes? Yes, teacher. Cool. Now, if you are, and this is another one very common, is when you are talking about next or last, okay? For example, some people say, I went on vacation the last month. Do I need the article though? Not really, yeah. right? Be careful with the microphones, please. So in this case, if you are using last, you don't need the article that. You just say last month, for example, last year, last hour, last weekend. It is not necessary the article that. This is the same when we use the word next. Sometimes we always say, ah, yes, the next week. Mm, no, only next week. Ah, yes, eh, I will go to the beach the next month. No, only next month. Understood, everybody? Is it clear the scenarios where we don't need the article? Yeah. For the moment, yes. <laughs> For the moment, I like that. Okay, any questions so far? Or ready for a practice? Could be. Could be, let's do it. Okay, I'm going to show you some sentences. We are going to resolve the exercise together, don't worry. You just have to choose if you need the article a, an, the article the, or if you don't need article at all, okay? Let me open up the exercise and I need to everybody try to resolve it. For example, look at the first one. Uh, we bought some cheese and ham. Look at this one. There is a dot over here, okay? So this one is a new sentence. So what do you think? The cheese. The article that. 
Mm -hmm. A cheese, yeah. that yeah. cheese, or I don't need that. The cheese, the cheese, the cheese. The second mention. Ah, okay. Are you sure about your answer? Yes. 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 Totally. Guys, sure. Extra homework for each mistake. Do you agree? Thank you, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, teacher. I agree. All right. All right. We have the weekend. I can give you extra homework. Okay. How about the next one? It's the ta ta interesting book. And um, and are you and sure? Yes. 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 Why? Yes. It's yes. the first mention. An interesting book. It's a first mention. It's a description. Yeah. Um, um, of something. Description. Yeah. Are you sure? Yes. yes. <laughs> All right. So good. So good. Now I will be asking individually. Let me pick someone. Du -du 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 -du. Lorena. Lorena, number three. What do you think? Um. There was um. A document. Ah, okay. Are you sure? Uh, yes. <laughs> All right. Guys, do you agree? A document? Yes. I agree. I agree. Yes. <laughs> okay. Lorena, pick one of your classmates, please. Nelson. Nelson. Come on. <laughs> that sounds like the revenge. That's true. What? From yesterday. Why? No, the revenge no. era with uh, is yeah. Uh, I don't remember, but uh, not Nelson. Ah, it wasn't Nelson. Ah, okay, I'm sorry, Nelson. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go ahead. Uh, experts say that. The coffee, a coffee or no article at all? The coffee. No article. <laughs> what do you could think? Could be, could be. Which one? No article. No article? Mm, uh, yes, no article because we are talking yeah. about uh, something is, uh, is not specific. It's in general, in coffee in general. Okay, are you sure? Yes. <laughs> Not bad. I yes. believe that. Yeah, I don't know, teacher. For me, it may be the, the. All right, look at this one. We have a debate, yes. everyone. Some yes. of you say that is no article needed because you said that you are talking in general. And some yes. people say that you need the article, the, the coffee. Because if you coffee. use that, you're referring to a specific type of coffee yes and not is a second mention it's a general well i don't know what kind of coffee is the first the first time that appears in that um sentence so no yeah. article no no article it's a general okay. category sounds good sounds good we are going to see it later okay extra Nelson. homework <laughs> extra homework Why sorry <laughs> Okay, este, Sigfrido. Sigfrido, number five, please. I don't have a car. I so don't sad. have a car. What do you think, guys? Do you agree? Yes. 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 Okay. Sigfrido, pick someone. Let me check. Um, Jose Estrubado. Thank you. Jose Salvador, number six, please. Not particularly. The last? The last one? No article? No article. Can you yes. pass me water? Yes. Are you yes. sure? Do you yes. agree, everybody? Yes. Okay. Yes. All right. Salvador, pick someone, please. Kevin Alexander. All right. Mm -hmm. Kevin? 
Okay. The. The president. Yes. Are you sure? Yes, 100% <laughs> because if I say ah, and, and I'm seeing him, it, I, I have to say that present. <laughs> <laughs> okay, everybody, do you agree? But it's a job, no? Yeah, the president. But I the think president is something like You're referring like to, to the person, but not the job, I think. Ah, yes. Ah. Because it's hey. a job, it's ah. Uh, ah. Uh, hey. But the, the president is like that. It's unique. The, the president is uh, unique. Uh -huh. For yes. me, it's da, because talking about the specific president of the country. Look at the, the sentence. The unique uh -huh. president uh -huh. of the country. Look at uh -huh. the sentence. Uh -huh. It's saying the president or a president visited our school. So I'm talking about a person that is the president or I'm talking about the job. No, it's, it's about person. person. Yes, it's that. All right. Okay. The. Okay. But the we... last one, I'm not, I am not agreeing. <laughs> All right. Kevin, go ahead. Pick someone. Uh, let me see. Um, Andrea? <laughs> All right, Andrea, number eight. Um, my father is a police officer. A police officer. Are you sure? Yeah. Yes. yes. Agree. I agree. Okay. Andrea, pick someone, please. Um. Okay. Um. Sorry, um, Osman. Osman, thank you. Number nine. Okay. Everybody knows that cats are very independent, independent animals. Okay, so no article. No article. Are you sure? Yes, I am sure. Everybody, do you agree? Yes. 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 Sounds, Sounds good. All right. It's general. Okay, Osman, pick someone, the last one. The last one, let me see, let me see, let me see. Uh, Ana Lorena? Lorena, okay. Refill for Lorena, go ahead. Okay. Congratulations. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Maybe um, the, the okay, she picked me up at the airport. Yes, yes, I believe. Okay, guys, do you agree? I agree because yes. it's a common place. Common place. I agree. <laughs> You know, something that I like is that now, guys, you are just analyzing the reason. That's excellent. That's what I need. All right. So are your answers correct, everybody? Or would you like to change one of them? Do you have some doubts? Yes, the number six, I have doubts. You have doubt with the number six. Can you pass me water? Hmm. Yeah. The water, a water, or no article at all? Can you pass me a water? A water? Nah. Mm -hmm. can you, can you I think it's that, water? but I, I don't All know. of my yeah. life, uh, I say the water. The water? <laughs> but I'm not sure it's, cor it's correct. Well... No article, okay. No article. No article. Okay. No article. Yes. This no is article. a democracy, right? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the homework. Uh, the homework is for everyone. <laughs> Thank you, Kevin. I didn't say that. I didn't ask. Ah, okay. That. Thank you, Nelson. Ah, uh, come on, come on. My oh. question. Sure. Yes. Mm, I don't know. I I I think number four. Uh -huh. Per say that 
I, I was thinking that, I don't know, because the coffee, the expert talking about in general, the coffee. Mm. So what do you think, guys? The coffee or just coffee? Mm, just, coffee. just coffee. Just coffee. Okay. Well, let's see, everybody. Let's see. Okay. Six. Ten, 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 ten. <laughs> do you still have doubts with the number six? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you, Kevin and Nelson. <laughs> Leave it as it is, leave it as it is, and let's check the answers. Are you ready, everybody? Hey. Ta -ta -ta I'm the one to see. <laughs> Ta -ta 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 Ooh, look at this six. one. Six. <laughs> check the number six. Check the number six. I am totally, that is the right. mistake. Oh, yeah, the number six. <laughs> told you, told you. <laughs> okay, look at this one. Look at the explanation. Uh, yes, we use the... the to talk about something specific, uh, specific things, specific people. But when it's clear which things are people that we are talking about. So remember, that is what we already talked about. The. In this sentence, look at this one. It's clear which water I'm talking about. That's what you have to imagine. Just Think and imagine the scene. Imagine that we are together. And suddenly I say, eh, Carlos, pásame el agua, please. ¿Sabe Carlos de qué agua estoy hablando? Yes. The water on the table. In that <laughs> case. The unique. The unique in the room. Could be, exactly. So remember, we use the article da when we believe that the other person knows exactly what I'm talking about, okay? If I say, can you pass me water? That means that, which water? I don't know. I'm just talking about water in water general. <laughs> Could be water from the ocean, <laughs> water the from the river. I don't know. We are from just the talking <laughs> Could be because we don't know exactly what water you are talking about. Okay, so um, look at this one. That was the only one, but the rest of the sentences, guys, you did a great, it's a very good job. Easy or difficult? What do you think? Difficult. <laughs> 50 50 but look at this guys you are doing great 10 sentences and it was only one mistake but i mean it was pretty good so if you participate a lot in the next part of the class maybe i will forget that i had to give you homework okay? day off thank you nelson <laughs> no, oh my answer is ah oh, come on all right Let's relax a little bit, everyone. Let's stop thinking about it, all right? And now we're going to switch the conversation and we are going to talk about apologies, excuses, and promises, okay? What is the meaning of apologies? Yes. What is that? Disculpas. Ah, very good. Excuses? Excuses. <laughs> And promises, right? Those words are pretty, um, obviously. Have you ever invented excuses? Yes. Oh my God, but not for the platform, right? No, for my friends. <laughs> ah, okay. Have you ever promised anything? Yes, all the time. And did you complete the promise? Did you do that? Mm -hmm. Almost all the time. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Have you ever guys apologized for a mistake or a wrong action? Yes. Yes. Okay. So today we are going to learn some phrases that we can use, some vocabulary that we can use about this topic. And the idea is to have some role plays. But I want you guys to relax a little bit. So we are going to speak again. We have some questions and I want you guys to discuss these questions with your classmates. For example, 
When was the last time you had to apologize to someone? Hmm. <laughs> Today. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. And why? So try to think about it in general. Don't overthink. Okay. If it is something like very personal, it's not necessary to give the details. Okay. No worries. Let's see. For this practice, we only have five minutes. Okay. So let me send chance on WhatsApp groups. Again, please enter to the breakup rooms. Remember that the idea for the breakup rooms is that you can feel free to participate, okay? It's the moment that you can feel free to speak. That is the main purpose for this class, right? That you speak. So let me just create a groups. Give me one second. If your classmate doesn't want to participate, <laughs> push them, motivate them to participate. Give me a second. Try them. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> All right, give me a moment. I'm just creating the groups. If you're in a group where nobody is participating, please let me know and I will switch you to another team. Ready, everybody? Yes? Okay, let's go to work. Hello. Hello. Did you hear me? It's yeah. raining here. I'm barely with a lot of reference. No. <laughs> it's my fun. <laughs> what? <laughs> my uh... fun. Ah, you hear it. Seems, but you can hear me. Yeah, it seems um, that you uh, you are on the street, or <laughs> or maybe it seems uh, it's raining in the neighborhood. <laughs> no, no, it's my fun. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, we have to to answer the questions. So the first one is, when was the last time you had to apologize to somebody and why? Mm. Uh, let let me, one second. I have a question, a teacher. For teacher, teacher, hello. Yes. yes. Uh, I, I have, Doubt, do that, doubt? Doubt. Doubt, uh, with pronunciation, apologies, apologize. 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 Mm, okay. Apologies is when you are talking about the noun. If you are um, talking about the verb, is apologize. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay, excuse me. Pamela. Okay, no worries. Okay, okay. The the first uh, question. When was the last time you had to apologize to somebody, and why? I am thinking. I don't remember. <laughs> Maybe um, maybe <laughs> with, my, with my sister, I think, oh, okay. <laughs> because he because she because she um, take my clothes. And I was so angry. <laughs> and then I have to apologize with her. <laughs> okay. 
And what about you, Carlos? Uh, for me, um, I, let's see. The, la, the last one. It was. Uh, uh, two months ago, uh, my wife, because. <laughs> Uh, we 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 fight we fought we we fight mm -hmm. so i you have to apologize <laughs> yes i apologize my wife <laughs> to my wife okay and you jose mm, i was last last week mm. my son llegó tarde a la escuela how do you say this later later to school mm -hmm. yes get And... late to school And what's my fault? And you have a post about it. Yes, yes. Okay. Uh, number two. Two. You know, are not little, maybe are not little mistakes, but I apologize in that short way. Okay. <laughs> you are uh, a man of pocas uh, palabras? I don't Few know words. What to say. Few words. Few words. Uh -huh. Sounds Few good. Words. Okay. Okay. What, what about Rafael? Rafael, where are you there? there? Yes, Rafael is here. He's listener. <laughs> I think so. Sorry, guys. I have a a call from. Okay. 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 Next question. Next question. I don't understand. Has someone ever blamed you for a mistake that wasn't your fault? Blame is when it's when a, someone takes la culpa. Exactamente. Oh, okay. Exactly. Exactly. That's blame. The teacher is here. Exactly. Yes. <laughs> okay. Oh, then you are teacher. I go to speak in Spanish, but the teacher. I'm just no, translating. No, no, don't don't <laughs> Okay. Yes. Um, someone blamed you to something. Blame for you something. Um, in my case, no. Uh, I don't remember because I never, I never did that. In my job, usually happens a lot because maybe, uh, maybe is missing something, and the only the only one that could have the 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 thing that is missing is always Alexis. Always <laughs> say Alexis has it. Alexis. Maybe took it. Alexis, go for Alexis and ask him. And I'm always don't touch anything. But I, but uh, how I'm so ordered, and I ha I like to get things ordered. The people think that I took it because I am used to getting getting everything in order. Mm -hmm. Do you get me? <laughs> I believe. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I yes. don't feel anything. Yes, okay. interesting. I am, uh, only I want to say something. In my uh -huh. company, we are uh, working a different way. Way uh, we had to try to work in in a team in team. Okay. Uh, work in team. Yes. Uh, this day I share with. Workers, a video. I don't. Okay. I don't know if I had. I don't know if I can share with you a little video. 
If you uh, want. It, yes. El, how can I how can I do? Uh, I teacher, teacher, can I share with my classmate uh, a, a video? Three minutes only that. Uh, what kind of video is it? Because what happens is that if we share third party video, um, oh. when I mm -hmm. upload the video on YouTube, the video can be banned or banned oh, or yes. canceled. Maybe when when this recording is not a good idea. Okay, okay. You can okay. share it on WhatsApp group. I mean, you can. It, it's it it's interesting because uh, in this video, uh, I speak about the uh, how do you say enemies? Enemies. Enemies. Mm. Enemies of team work team or team work. All right, you can send yes. it. Send it on WhatsApp. Yes, yes. You it's in it. Spanish. Okay, it's mm -hmm. in Spanish, but uh, I would like because. Uh, the first reason is uh, ego. Okay. El, el, el ego is Selfish. the first, uh, and the second is the, the compromiso. Oh. Okay. Commitment. Um, I'm going to share this video. Uh, you, you can see late. Yes. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Okay. The other question. <laughs> and we we are planning. The the meetings like for two day, days after uh, we we I we ask him <laughs> okay, <laughs> like need, we I, ask I, him that on Monday he he say us that he can uh, make we can have a meeting on Wednesday or Friday. So <laughs> hey 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 boss, I need help right now. Okay, and um, I put a meet uh, maybe Wednesday the next week. <laughs> so and you are, are you are. <laughs> You're in a hurry. In a hurry. <laughs> yes. Man, I have an issue, a special issue, and I set up a meeting in for the last week of of September. <laughs> in a hurry, right? <laughs> okay. For he is not a priority. For me, it's like a priority too. So I hope the thing is not burning out. <laughs> <laughs> man he, he, he's pretty funny to get attendance with him and also he's participating in a lot of projects so has a lot of knowledge uh, this is difficult in some cases because you really need help from him no that is good it's good when you have a boss and, and he he really knows about when you are about what talking about or working about but if you have a boss and he asks you all the things to you because he yeah. didn't know anything, <laughs> it's something like, uh, why I am not a boss? <laughs> yes, I had a boss in my last work like that. <laughs> well, yeah. let's okay. continue to the next question. Do okay. you the find it, it? No, number three. <laughs> number three. Do you find it easy to... <laughs> Complicated? person but but sometimes i think it's a little difficult to forgive something like like too big i i don't know <laughs> but yes. it, like in the little mistakes with with your friends with your family i think that i'm not complicated i'm not complicated with that but maybe maybe when when something really really what uh, big happens i don't know maybe yes. a little difficult <laughs> to forgive <laughs> but yeah. i don't know what to think <laughs> i agree with you all right time's up Let's wait for your classmates. Time's up, everyone. Time's up, time's up. All right, let's wait for everybody. If some of your classmates are still in your breakout rooms. Let's wait for them. Time's up, time's up. All 
All right, all right. Time's up. Let's go back. Let's see. All right, all right. I was listening to very interesting answers. Oh my gosh. How was the practice? Was it easy to answer the questions? Yes, yeah, that was so funny. <laughs> yeah, I was listening um, to all kind of details. That's interesting. All right, so if you see, we're just talking about um, apologies, we are just talking about some excuses, some promises, and talking about that specific word, apologies. Remember, if it is the noun, we say apologies. For example, you can say, um, receive my apologies. That is the noun. But if you want to use the verb, you use apologize. For example, I want to apologize for my mistake. So the pronunciation is a little bit difficult, okay? Now, let's see. Let me pick someone. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Carlos Mauricio. Hello, Carlos. Hello. Do you remember when was the last time that you had to apologize? Mm, the last time. Yes, well, the last week. And why? Uh, it wasn't my fault, to be honest, but... <laughs> <laughs> because sure? my... Yes, I'm sure. <laughs> because for my position, I had to, to take the responsibility and say apologize to my boss. Oh, <laughs> okay, that's good. You take the responsibility. That's nice. Yes. All right, can I say the last week or only last week? Oh my God, last week. <laughs> Thank you, that's the one. Thank you, Carlos, pick one of your classmates, please. Uh, thank you, Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Kevin, tell me, yes. Kevin, um, has someone ever blamed you for a mistake that wasn't your fault? Yes. Really? When? Yes, yesterday. Oh my gosh, it's very recently. <laughs> oh yes, my and sister what... tried to blame me for something in my house. <laughs> and what do you do? Um, I just hit her. I, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's no, go, let's I, call I, the police. <laughs> I, I just uh, fight with her, uh, speaking. Mm, <laughs> um, okay. I excuse me. <laughs> no, I I didn't uh, apologize with her. She I make a, she to apologize with me. <laughs> she has to do it. Okay, yes. sounds good. All right, <laughs> Kelly, pick one of your classmates, please. Um, let me check. Uh, Carlos Dominguez. Dominguez. I don't know. If he listener. Listener. <laughs> I think he's here. Hello, Carlos. Carlos Dominguez, you there? Okay, then let's go for Carlos Ernesto. Carlos Ernesto, are you there? Hi. <laughs> Carlos, do you find that it's easy to forgive someone? Depend, depend. Talking about uh, the team. Uh, it's not the same. It depends on the fault. Ah, the reason. Uh, the reason. The fault. Mm -hmm. Because uh, it's not the same, for example, fault in the family, uh, fault in the relationship, mm -hmm. or uh, fault in the job. That's true. Totally. Very good. Interesting answer. Thank you, Carlos. Pick the last one, please. Um, Andrea. Andrea. Hello, Andrea. Hello. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, it's okay. All right, Andrea, tell me, do you regret anything that you did or that you didn't do recently? Yes, I was. I was uh, telling my 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 uh, classmate that I regret 
not to save enough money at this time of the year. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's a good one. But, but I, I enjoy I enjoy wasting my money. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You regret, but like 50%, right? <laughs> she doesn't regret have save save money, but she no, she regrets not saving money, but she doesn't regret using the money. Enjoying it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pretty nice. All right. Now those questions are related with the vocabulary that we are going to study. Look at this one. Um, I have here some phrases. And I have here some definitions. We just need to match them. For example, if I'm talking about apologize, apologize for something. What do you think, guys? What is the meaning of that? Give a reason or explain why you did something wrong. Okay, so the letter B. What do you yes. think, guys? Do you agree? Apologize for something. Give a reason or explain why you did something wrong. Yes. Are you sure? Mm, say that um, you Maybe literal E. Say, say, or that, or you or say e. that you are sorry for something. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. E. Mm, okay, B or E? E. E. E is e. a better, better option. Okay, let's try with the letter E. If later you want to change your opinion, we can change. No worries. How about the next one? Forgive. Let's write the verbs, everybody. These verbs are important. We have the verbs apologize, the verb forgive. Okay, so write it. <laughs> Forgive somebody for something. What is that? Maybe letter D. Letter D. Stop being angry with someone. What do you think, guys? Do you agree? Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Yes? Okay. How about make an excuse? Be careful with the microphones. Letter B. Letter B, give a reason or explain why you did something wrong. What do you think, guys? Yes. I agree. Yes. Are you sure? Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> All right. Now, important, guys, when we are talking about excuse, I mean, to give an explanation about why you did something wrong, remember, we always say may. Okay, make an excuse. We don't say give an excuse, um, do an excuse, tell an excuse. No, we say make, right? Then number four, look at the verb, blame. Blame a. somebody. Uh -huh. a. Letter a. a. Letter A. Letter A, okay. So say or think that a particular person is responsible for something bad or wrong. Hmm. Some of you were saying, right, that you were blamed for something. Okay. Extra homework. <laughs> totally. Explain something. Letter C. Letter C. Letter C. Can you read it, please? Make, Make something. something clearer and easier to understand by giving more details about it. Very good. Excellent. And the last one, regret. Feel sorry or disappointed. <laughs> like some of you, right? You feel regret is because you feel disappointed about an action. Okay? So look at this one. Again, copy the verbs. Okay, they are the key for this vocabulary. So, have you ever made an excuse? Yes. Not in the English yes. class. <laughs> yes. Really? Oh my goodness. Why? What happened? For example, I was working in hotel. So, 
maybe when we had an, some issue with some uh, guests mm -hmm. or for example we need to change the rooms or we need to explain about uh, the water is missing or something else uh, we made excuses some letters and some visits about okay cool and you guys have you ever make an excuse Yes. <laughs> when? Mm, to not go to a party with my friends. To stay <laughs> at home. <laughs> Do you and, prefer and to stay rest. at home? And that day, yes. <laughs> because okay. I was uh, tired. <laughs> <laughs> but oh. this, so I have to make an excuse. <laughs> <laughs> okay, pretty good. Now, is it clear this vocabulary, guys? Yeah. Yes. Yes. What is the simple past of apologize? Apologize. Yes. Regular. Apologize. What is the past of forgive? Forgot. 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 Mm, forgot. Forgot. Okay. Okay. For Forgive. For Forgive. Be careful. Forgive is past participle. Mm, no, no, what happens is, is you are confusing with this one. Forgot. Forgot. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're, you're, uh -huh. that, that's good. That's true. different. It's this true. one is forgave or forgiven. Forgiven. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Make. Made. 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 Blame. Blamed. 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 Explain. 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 Regret. 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 Okay, so far so good. I liked it. Now, we already practiced vocabulary. We already practiced some speaking. Let's practice some listening. And if we oh still God. have time, we are going to have some role plays. But I think that the time is not going to be enough. Now, listen, I have here six conversations. You have to pay attention in the audio and you have to tell me in which place do you consider that the, each conversation took place. For example, in the number one, mm, you have to pay attention and say, ah, I think that they are in a restaurant. Or you can say, no, I think that they are in a house. Okay, you have to pay attention and try to identify where the conversation took place. Also, I want you to try to understand what happened. What are they talking about? Try to identify keywords, okay? So my recommendation is in your notebooks, try to write it the key words that you understand, okay? So, in order to avoid interferences, you know what to do, microphones off, everybody, please. So, I'm going to play the audio, pay attention, here we go. Dialogue one. I'm so sorry I'm late. My train was canceled, so I had to take the bus. Oh, that's okay. I've actually just arrived myself. My train was half an hour late. Dialogue 2. I want to apologize for my behavior during the meeting yesterday. It won't happen again. Listen, don't worry about it. I know you've been under a lot of stress recently. Thank you for your understanding, but I feel terrible. I'll buy coffee for the whole team for the rest of the week. Dialogue 3. Excuse me, who ordered the soup? Me. I'm afraid we don't have any left. I'm sorry for my mistake. Oh, it's okay. In that case, I'll have the salad, please. Of course. I'll remove your drinks from the bill. Thank you. We really appreciate that. Dialogue 4. Sorry to keep you waiting. The store manager is with another customer right now. This is really unacceptable. I can't wait here all day. He'll be with you as soon as he can, ma'am. Dialogue 5. I'm really sorry about the mess I made. I'll go and get the vacuum cleaner. Oh, it doesn't matter. Are you sure your husband won't mind? He isn't here. He won't be back until tomorrow. 
Dialogue 6. We sincerely apologize for losing your parcel, sir. I'm afraid that's not good enough. I expect some sort of refund. I understand, sir. You will receive a 20% discount on your next order. All right. Do you have the answers? Yes. Yes. Are you sure? Or do you want to listen it to one more time? Okay. Yes? One okay. more time? Or do you have the answers? One more time. Please. All right. Now, verify your answers, but also remember, try to identify what is happening in the conversation. Why are they apologizing? And what's happening? Okay. Microphone off, please. I'm going to play the audio again. Here we go. Dialogue one. I'm so sorry I'm late. My train was canceled, so I had to take the bus. Oh, that's okay. I've actually just arrived myself. My train was half an hour late. Dialogue two. I want to apologize for my behavior during the meeting yesterday. It won't happen again. Listen, don't worry about it. I know you've been under a lot of stress recently. Thank you for your understanding, but I feel terrible. I'll buy coffee for the whole team for the rest of the week. Dialogue 3. Excuse me, who ordered the soup? Me. I'm afraid we don't have any left. I'm sorry for my mistake. Oh, it's okay. In that case, I'll have the salad, please. Of course. I'll remove your drinks from the bill. Thank you. We really appreciate that. Dialogue 4. Sorry to keep you waiting. The store manager is with another customer right now. This is really unacceptable. I can't wait here all day. He'll be with you as soon as he can, ma'am. Dialogue 5. I'm really sorry about the mess I made. I'll go and get the vacuum cleaner. Oh, it doesn't matter. Are you sure your husband won't mind? He isn't here. He won't be back until tomorrow. Dialogue 6. We sincerely apologize for losing your parcel, sir. I'm afraid that's not good enough. I expect some sort of refund. I understand, sir. You will receive a 20% discount on your next order. All right. Ready, everybody? Yes. Yes. Okay, let's talk about the first dialogue. What is happening in the first dialogue? Train station. Train station. station. Okay, where is it? In which place? Train station. In train station. Train station. Train station. And what is happening? Uh, the train, they lose their train. Okay, what happens here? Um, be careful with the microphones, I'm sorry. He was so late because his train was canceled. canceled. So that's why he arrived late. Dialogue two, where did the dialogue two take place? He was the late office. at the, the, office. the office. The office. At the office? Yeah. Yes. It's, it's in the number two right here. Okay. And I like the part at the end. What did he say? He is going to give coffee. Coffee, coffee, coffee for, for all. everyone. Coffee for week. everyone. Yes. Imagine. That's funny. Dialogue three. Where? In the restaurant. In the restaurant. And what is happening there? Restaurant. Uh, they don't have no soup, more soup. So he wants a salad. Salad. Was she angry? No, no. So, not really. She yeah. was pretty nice, actually. I, I was surprised. Number four. What happens in the number four? In a house. Store. In oh, a sorry. House. Store. store. In a house or store. in a store? No, no, no. In a store. A I'm, store. I'm in a store. That's the one. And how was the customer in this scenario? I'm very angry. Angry. She was angry. That's true. Yes. yes. Number five? House. In a house. In the house. house, very strange for. I yeah. know. I it's know. The lover. Believe me, that's the lover. Yes. yes. <laughs> Something like it's that. Like she was cheating uh, on. My right? husband is not here. Come on. <laughs> he will come on to. That is not the truth. No, believe me that I wanted to cut uh, the audio in this part. <laughs> 
<laughs> but I didn't have enough time for it. So there but... is a lot of empathy for the husband <laughs> here. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> okay. And the last one, number six. Post office. Post office. And the post office. And what's happening there? They the lost a the off. They lost a what? A package. A package. A package. Yes. They didn't say package. They said they another parcel. Parcel. Yes, that is the same. Now, if you pay attention, when they were apologizing, they were using different phrases. Okay. And we are going to try to learn some of those phrases. For example, I have here this conversation. If I'm using or if I'm trying to apologize, imagine that this is a dialogue. What is the correct order? What will be the first sentence? What do you think? I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry? Oh, well, in this case, I'm so sorry. Do you agree, guys? Is this the first one? Yes, yes I agree. Okay. So, I'm so sorry. Instead of saying, I'm so sorry, what else can we say? According to the dialogues, what other phrases did you listen to? I apologize. May apologize. Ah, I apologize. For arriving late this morning. For arriving late. What else? Another phrase that we can use? I regret. <laughs> <laughs> Could be. Um, I really apologize. It's not my plane. It's the train. <laughs> <laughs> All right. But listen, instead of I'm so sorry, also you can use I'm really sorry. What else? Another phrase that you remember from the audios? Mm. Uh -huh. All right, you can use, I want to apologize, oh. okay? Um, so I'm really sorry for arriving late or I'm so sorry for arriving late. Or you can use, you know what? I want to apologize for arriving late. So different phrases that we can use. So imagine that your classmates say, I'm sorry for arriving late. What's next? Mm, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it? What happened? Do you agree, guys? Yes? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Well, I'm trying to draw the number two, but I can't. <laughs> All right. So imagine that somebody is asking you to apologize, him. Something that we can answer is just don't worry about it. For example, when you say, teacher, I'm going to be a listener today, my answer can be like, don't worry don't about it. Okay, what else can we say? It's okay. It's okay, yes. Another one? I was stuck. I'm sorry? I was stuck in the traffic jam on the ah. All right, that is the next one. So what happened? I was stuck in a traffic jam. Do you agree? Yes. All right. So look, you apologize, but also, guys, you have to explain. Okay. So I really regret not taking the train. <laughs> I'm not sure about it, right? But what is next? Mm -hmm. Oh, don't blame yourself. Ah, don't blame yourself. We're all late sometimes. So look, this is a very nice phrase that you can use. I know that the most common ones is like, ah, don't worry, it's okay. But also you can use this one. Uh, don't blame yourself, okay? It doesn't matter. And this phrase sounds 
pretty good, especially if you are in your job. Imagine that you are the supervisor and one of your member of the team made a mistake. So he felt terrible. He felt really sorry about it. You can say, hey, don't blame yourself. This happens. This can happen to anyone, right? So it's a pretty nice phrase. And the last one at the end, how we can end this conversation. Thanks, Thanks for, for your understanding. Yes. Thanks for your understanding. Okay. That's a pretty nice phrase. And of course, the promise. What is the it promise? It won't happen tomorrow. It won't happen tomorrow. Or we can say it would happen again. Yeah. Right? So that is a promise. You have to do it. Okay? Now, let's see another conversation. Tell me the correct order. Look at this one. What is the first one? I'm sorry I missed your presentation last night. All right, I'm sorry I missed your presentation. Do you agree, guys? Yes. Hello. Yes, teacher. Yes. So if I start the conversation with, I'm sorry, I missed your presentation last night. You see, I had to stay late at work. Are you sure? Okay, so what will be next? I'm afraid that really isn't a good excuse, enough excuse. You knew how important it was to me. Ah, look at this one. Do you think that the person is angry in this moment? Yes. Yes. Hmm. So what can you answer, guys, when you feel angry with someone? Don't use <laughs> bad words. Instead of that, you can say, Mm -mm. I'm afraid that that's not a really good excuse, all right? Or it's not a good enough excuse. That sounds much better than saying bad words, okay? And then you can explain why that excuse, it's not enough. Look, you knew how important it was to me, right? Or you knew that I needed you. You knew that this was pretty important. Okay, we need to use different expressions. What is next? Number three, what do you think? No, maybe I know. No. I know no. I just no. my boss no. as really. Ah, so look at this one. I know, okay. It's just as my boss asked me to stay late. What is next? Don't blame your don't your blame boss. your boss. You knew about you it. Knew about <laughs> Do you think that he's angry? <laughs> yes. Yes. I'm real. I feel scared right now, and that's, that's maybe maybe it's the girlfriend. <laughs> Could be. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like that. And the last one. I'm so sorry. I'll definitely be at your next presentation, I promise. Very good. Look, I'm so sorry. And again, guys, normally when we made a mistake and then we apologize, we ended with a promise, right? Like, it won't happen again, okay? I'll do the... Ta -ta 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 -ta. You can explain what will you do for the next situation, okay? For example, I'll definitely be at your next presentation, okay? I will buy you um, something. <laughs> I will give you some money, I promise, okay? So we end the conversation with a promise, okay? Now, the idea is to have some role plays 
but unfortunately we don't have more time. So tomorrow we are going to have some role plays about it, making excuses or when you promise something or if you want to apologize. But well, that is going to be tomorrow because we don't have more time. Do you have any questions about that topic? Any questions so far? No. No, no. no Good. Okay. Now, before leaving, the winner for tonight, Andrea. You have the win. You are the winner for tonight. The rest of you guys, you are totally <laughs> free to go. Have a wonderful night. Take care. Work on the platform, please. See you tomorrow. Thanks. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Good night. Take care. Goodbye. All right, Andrea. I think your classmates are listeners, and so that's why they are still here. No worries. This little okay. meeting is just to clarify some questions that you may have about the topics, about the class, or about the platform, or about the program in general. So this is your moment. <laughs> Do you have any question or comments so far? I really um having difficult. I have difficult to um like advance advance. Mm -hmm. or do the uh, exercise on the platform but i i try i will try to uh get um to uh, or advance yeah yeah advance at 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 the weekend but maybe i have like uh questions that when we have to uh when we have to 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 have when we have to uh, I don't know. Really? Sorry. <laughs> when do you have yeah, to finish when, everything? Yeah, when 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 I have to finish the platter for all the exercise of the activities. Well, basically, you know that today uh, we are already working in the unit number four. So yeah, but and and not in the unit number two, but the, that was the last. I know. I, I, I can see. I can see that you already finished the unit number two, so you are going to yeah. start the unit number three. Now, yes. um, the last day for this level is next Tuesday, right? Okay. So, uh, I'm talking about September. Tuesday. Tuesday. Yes. Okay. So, so before September twelfth, I mean Tuesday, everything has to be done. Mm -hmm. okay thank so, you yeah, yeah i will try to to this to do this on on sunday <laughs> yeah. because i have to work on saturday so oh, really oh my god i will try yeah i will try to do it now i now i will try i will do it on, <laughs> do have to. yeah, yeah. And, uh, remember if you have some issues with some exercises you can take a screenshot and send it uh, I recommend you to send it on WhatsApp's group because some of your classmates already did it. So they can help you with that in case that I cannot answer like as soon as possible, all right? Or you can tell me and here in the class, we can discuss some of the exercises and I can help you with that. Uh, but yeah, you have to. In Remember that in the unit number two, there is the midterm. Um, it is necessary that you take the midterm too. The, okay. You need to finish the unit number four. And at the end of the unit number four, we have the last exam that also you need to finish it. Okay? Okay, yeah. Pretty good, excellent. Um, another question that you may have about the topics, for example, or the classes? Mm, mm, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know question how do you feel yeah, the, the i topic? try to do my best <laughs> i know and you are you are doing a lot um i like the way that when you are here you always try to participate so that's a good feedback that i have for you actually the only feedback that it was um well the only one that i'm going to say it was the platform but you already explained the reason why mm -hmm. you couldn't finish it yet so yeah. Yes, I know I have a little problem. I think that I have like all my day like 
if I if I do something, I did I do I can do something. Uh -huh. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I know, and I know, and I totally understand to all of you. I mean, you have to work. You have your house, you have your family, you have to travel in the middle of the traffic. I know it's yeah. difficult. So that's why I always say that if you have issues with an exercise, tell me. And I try to help you as soon as possible in order that you can feel that it's easier for you. All right. So please, if you have any exercise, like you don't know what to do, just let me know and we are going to help you. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Excellent. Okay. okay, Andrea, if you don't have more questions, let's just stop here. Thank you so much for being in the class. And I want to see you tomorrow, always ready to participate, okay? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Excellent. Thank you. Good night. Wonderful night. Goodbye.